Well, it's you. This is Edwin Dearborn coming to you live from Public Us in downtown Las Vegas. And yes, that is a giant steak and hash browns and eggs and toast as their wall art. And on Caffeinated Content, we talk about great business ideas over a hot cup of coffee. And Public Us has got great coffee. So if you're ever in Las Vegas, you gotta come here. Great breakfast, great coffee, really a popular spot with all the locals. Today I wanna to talk about that big idea as your USP, your unique selling proposition. My company, Premier Lead Systems, is gonna be rebranded based on this concept and I think it's very, very important that you understand what we mean by the big idea. The big idea is not just this really amazing idea you had one night. The big idea is your ability to differentiate yourself with a process that is so powerful, so unique, so transformational that it stops people in their tracks and you become the obvious choice. You're no longer on a level of me too or being a competitor. You're the dominating force that they really want to be a part of. So one of the struggles we've had with our company, and our company is growing, like every month we get more and more customers, but is, well, I know other people that do what you do. Uh, what makes you different than blah, right? And it's as a digital marketer, you know, you want to say, well, we give good service and we really care about people, but in actual fact, other digital marketing companies and advertising agencies care about their customers and they work hard and, you know, for the most part. So we sat down after three years and we, we really analyzed what is the big impact? What's the big result that customers really want? And then how do we reverse engineer that as a process that not only makes us different than the other organizations, but brings about more loyalty because they see that we're playing the big game. We're playing a long-term game. And you'll be seeing our brand new branding and unique selling proposition, our big idea, very, very shortly. We want to announce it on July 4th, because I love July 4th. And right now we're going through our whole logo redesign, our whole new positioning, uh, packaging, we're even coming out with swag, with shirts and uh, hats and coffee mugs, because I love coffee, and all this stuff, and it's gonna be this big wow. And I've been running it by some of my clients, and I have had 1,000% positive feedback going, wow, now that's what I really want. I don't want just leads, I just don't want advertising, I want that big impact that you just told me about. So our whole big idea is going to be that market differentiator. So now this comes down to like, well, if you're an insurance agent or a real estate agent or, or a dentist or a chiropractor, it's really easy to kind of fall into that me too category as a brand. You know, well, I know a lot of realtors. Oh, well, if I don't like you as a chiropractor, I can just go to another chiropractor. Oh, I, my brother sells life insurance. Why would I buy it from you, right? Life insurance is life insurance. And what really brought this home to me was last night, uh, we had a fantastic dinner, a friend and I, uh, Peter Ponce de Leon, uh, one of my partners, and he is, sells insurance, annuities, uh, all types of uh, investment products. Some of these investment products are extremely complex and very rarely known, all of them legal. And we were talking about this big idea and how this big idea not only attracts bigger customers, but keeps those bigger customers with you for even longer, in fact, probably for the lifetime. And so as a wealth management expert, we, we came up with some verbiage that's completely true that positions him clearly above any other wealth manager, above any other insurance salesperson, because he's grabbing the big idea of what he wants 
to create that impact upon his customers. This positive, huge, undeniable, like wow, no one has ever talked to me like that. That's what we want to do with the big idea. Okay, now <clears throat> I will admit that creating your big idea can be a big challenge because it really has to be genuinely a big idea. It can't just be something that you think is a big idea and then the marketplace goes, mm, it's not that big. It's got to be viewed, it's got to have the impact, a big impact upon your audience. So my suggestion is, is while you're developing your big idea, if this is of interest to you, that you, you begin to test it. You take some of your better clients or some of your friends, and, you, and before you announce it or formulate it or package it, go to five or 10 clients or possible clients and beta test this message to see if it works on them. Is this something that if I offer this as a service, if I offer this as a brand proposition or as my unique selling proposition, would that catch your attention? Does that excite you, this big idea? And what I found is the big idea that my partner and I developed does capture people's attention. It actually goes, wow. No one's ever said it that way, but yet that is the result that I want. I want to be at that place as a business, the way you articulated it, the way you described it, and you have a process to take me there that you're willing to share with me and demonstrate and show me how to do it step by step. Holy shit balls, I'm on board. See, that's the impact that you want to have. So getting there may take a lot of work, but I can tell you, the minute you pass over that hump and you've got a big idea that truly works and reverberates within the marketplace, wow, you're gonna attract way more customers, you're gonna be more bold in your marketing, you're gonna get more referrals, and they're gonna spend more money, and they're gonna stay with you longer. That's a fact. That's the power of the big idea. Now, if you need some assistance in this, I'd love to give you some assistance. I'm not saying that I'm the guy that's got all the bright ideas. I'm just saying I'm a willing person who understands the concept, who's willing to work with ambitious individuals to go through that process and you know the ups and downs and the emotional intellectual challenges to get you there potentially. If that is of interest to you, you should reach out to me. Reach out through me through direct messenger or you can call me, uh, you can tweet me, you can email me. There's plenty of ways you can reach me. But I think this is a very, very important factor that if you're really gonna take your game to the next level, you have to start working on a path of creating that big idea that develops into a big promise and a big process that then has a big impact which attracts you big attention and big dollars. That's what the big idea is about. Okay, hopefully this stirring some thoughts for you. This is Edwin Dearborn, author of Power Branding Secrets. We'll talk to you soon, bye-bye.